In this video, we will be studying about the stomata and the section through a leaf. See, we all know that plants make their own food. They are the producers. The process through which the plants make their own food is known as photosynthesis. Now, leaves are the food factors of plant. The synthesis of food in plants occur in leaves. Therefore, all the raw material must reach there. Water and minerals present in the soil are absorbed by the root and transported to the leaves. Carbon dioxide from air is taken through the tiny pores present on the surface of the leaves. These pores are surrounded by guard cells. Such pores are called stomata. So let's see the stomata. Now this is the diagram of stomata. It is the you know opening through which the carbon dioxide from the air is taken in the these pores in the leaves are called stomata and these are surrounded by these guard cells can you see these cells these are the guard cells now this part is known as stomata which is open stomata that air they are taking in then this is chloroplast cell wall this is cell wall stomata nucleus vacuole right so this is how the stomata looks and this is the closed stomata when the air is not taken inside right so carbon dioxide from air is taken in through the tiny pores present on the surface of the leaves. These pores are called these pores are specially surrounded by guard cells and such pores are called stomata now this is a pore this is the opening so this is known as your stomata it is surrounded by the guard cells and there is a vacuole then nucleus cell wall and chloroplast in this now see the leaves of the plant helps to prepare the food so one section of the leaf is stomata that we have started about now let's see the vertical section through a leaf now how the leaf looks like from inside now there is a green pigment in the leaf known as chlorophyll Can you find out where the chlorophyll is in this figure? Right. Now, as there is no, uh, nothing like a chlorophyll, so let me tell you that this part, this is chlorophyll. In the leaf. Right. Now this chlorophyll, it helps leaves to capture the energy of sunlight see we all know that plant prepare uh, uh, plant can prepare their food in the presence of sunlight as well as they require water and carbon dioxide to prepare the food right now uh, there is a green pigment in the leaves which make it green is the chlorophyll it helps to capture the energy of the sunlight this energy is used to synthesize or prepare food from carbon dioxide and water since the synthesis of food occurs in the presence of sunlight it is known as photosynthesis now this is the vertical section of the leaf how the leaf looks like these are wax cuticles upper epidermis palisade cell 
then uh, here it is air space which through which the air can come and go then now here are the spongy cells lower epidermis then stomata guard cells we have studied the how stomata looks like in the uh, previous slide so this is how the leaf is do download our scholars learning app and enjoy the learning experience with us